it's rude rare users of unloved discarded excess and it's rude girl here with rude boy and he's doing some little job i don't know what he's doing he's pottering around making a mess and making That's a noise nice. yes and i'm sick and you're doing i've got me out of bed to film this i got inspired to convert get this little tape we we had of our daughter's debs and I was inspired when um, Rude Girl had a whole heap of tapes, of these tapes, to be changed over to digital. So I've done that, and I was waiting for a nice wet day, I suppose you could call it, to um, work out a way to get that to digital. Now, I was going to borrow a VHS video camcorder, but couldn't find one looked on ebay not a real lot too much for just changing that next step was there's an adapter that these actually go into on a big tape again maybe could have got one on ebay but again far too much uh, for just one tape that's all we have is that one tape so bit of uh, youtubing bit of google and I was able to find a video that showed me pulling this apart, taking the tape out of that, and putting into that, which will enable me to play it in a normal VHS player. So I did that this morning, pulled this apart. As you can see, there's no tape left in there. And it's all gone. Yes. So what I did... Someone's wedding. We got someone's wedding from the freebie bin at a local op shop. Yes, I was going to say that because the universe provided. We were just talking about it and Karen came back to the car after not being successful in the freebie bin and said, oh, there's some tapes there of drag racing or something. So I went there and found some basically brand new tapes and one was obviously a wedding. So... I was able to change those reels and put the tape onto these reels and first of all that's a drive tape or drive wheel on the left hand side there so I used that put that one in there hooked it up to the um, to this one how do you hook it up well there's a little tab in there that you've got to pull out and it's too it's fiddly. fiddly. Too fiddly to, to sort of explain, but it does come out. And then I was able to get it back to the start and play it in the in our video player, which in turn is linked up to the computer, which is linked up to this thing, which will record there and put it to digital. So... After doing that, we've got it on digital. I then fast forwarded to the end, so all the tape was on this right hand one, and this small one was left on that side. So I did exactly the same thing, got it to the end, unhooked the little tab, put the big wheel in, back in, and just rewound it back onto there, and it just looks like a normal tape now. The two big wheels are there, and that tape that was in there is now in there. Good, so we've got a backup. So that's the actual uh, original source and we've got that tape on the little flash drive now mm. to no doubt share around. Well, how did you find out how to do that? That's very clever. As I said, um, Google YouTube. And that was sort of having a bit of a I guess I thought I could be able to do that but again it's always nice to just see someone else doing it and um, confirm what you thought well done thanks rude boy that's okay looks like I've got some more movies to edit yes and the main thing is it cost us nothing cost us nothing and nice gifts for Christmas because yep. they will be getting an edited version of their Debs for Christmas yes yes bye